Tony here with Learn Audio Basics. I'm gonna show you how to connect your XLR microphone to your laptop or PC. Let's go. Some of the items you're gonna to need to connect that XLR microphone to your PC or laptop are going to be an XLR cable. Typically, it's gonna be a female XLR to male XLR. And you're going to need an audio interface. Now your audio interface is going to come with the cable that you're gonna to need to connect from the interface to your laptop or PC. It's just a USB cable, typically, with the proper connector for the back of your interface. In my example, I have a Focusrite Scarlett 2i2, an older generation. So one thing you're gonna wanna do is connect your XLR female end to your XLR microphone. Once you hear that click, you know you're good. To release, simply squeeze the button and release. On the Scarlett 2i2, you have two inputs. Once you've connected your XLR cable to the microphone itself, you're going to need to connect that male end of the XLR to your interface. On this interface, you have a built-in microphone preamplifier or a preamp. So you want to set your switch and then set your gain. This particular microphone I'm using is a dynamic microphone, which does not use the 48 volts power switch. We don't want to engage that with this type of microphone. It will damage it. Next, you'll connect your interface to your laptop or PC, typically via USB or some other connector depending on the interface and the laptop or PC you're working with. Now, once you've done that, then it's up to your DAW, your digital audio workstation, as far as getting your microphone signal into the software and recording yourself. If there's a particular software that you're unsure about, let me know down in the comments and I'll help you get through it. All right, as you can see, we are now inside of Pro Tools. We just hooked up an XLR microphone to our laptop. You can do this easily with a PC as well. Thanks for stopping by. Again, this is Learn Audio Basics. There you go, it's that simple and easy. Don't let anything hold you back, all right? If you like this video, leave a comment down below with your favorite part and what you'd like to see in the next video. As always, links to these items will be found in the description below. Go ahead and check out the other videos on the channel. I like to be creative and help you in different ways. Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, this is Tony with Learn Audio Basics. Subscribe for more helpful tips in audio. Peace.